I try really hard to not be anti-religion, to be religiously tolerant, but my god, the damage that religion and Christianity in particular has done to anthropology makes me extremely upset. And this isn't even just an Africa thing, it exists all over the world. They go in, loot, pillage, steal, whatever, force the native populations to convert, and then once that conversion has happened, everyone doesn't want to admit that their ancestors are probably charbroiling in hell according to Christian theology, so they just make some shit up about how Christianity has always been the case. There is so much knowledge that has been lost because of Christian fucking missionaries. My grandparents in Nigeria have English first names because of the Catholic Church. Religious fanatics with power and weapons are the most dangerous people on the planet. The Rising African Movement to Denounce Christianity Africa's Denunciation of Christianity The African continent has seen an increase in the number of people denouncing Christianity. This is due to the rise of Islam, which has become a more attractive option for many Africans. Africa is beginning to see a rise in the number of people denouncing Christianity and converting to Islam. This is due to Islam being a more attractive option for many Africans. This is due to the rise in popularity of Islam as an alternative to Christianity. Why is Africa rejecting Christianity? In the past, Christianity was a dominant religion in Africa. However, it has been rejected in recent years for various reasons. Many Africans reject Christianity because they believe its teachings are too closely related to Western culture and values. Furthermore, Christian groups have also been accused of being too close to the colonialists and the white people. In addition to this, some Africans believe that Christianity is not relevant enough to their lives and does not provide them with any practical solutions for their problems. For example, many Christians are against homosexuality and same-sex marriage, which is not compatible with African culture. Christianity in Africa and the dangers it poses for the continent. There are many religions in Africa and Christianity is one of them. Christianity is the most popular religion in Africa. It has been on the continent for a long time and it has become an integral part of African culture. The Christian religion came to Africa with European colonialists and missionaries who were trying to convert Africans to Christianity. The dominance of the Christian religion can be seen in all aspects of life in Africa, from education, politics, business, and even personal relationships. The Christian religion has had a huge impact on the continent, but there are also some dangers that come with it as well. One of these dangers is that Christianity teaches people to have faith in God instead of themselves, which means that they don't take responsibility for their own actions or decisions. This can lead to laziness, which will ultimately hurt African countries as they try to develop themselves economically. The Future for Christians in Africa Christians are the dominant religious group in Africa, and they are projected to continue to grow. There is a significant growth of Christianity in Africa, with an estimated 700 million Christians living there by 2050. Christians make up about 60% of the population in Africa and have been growing at a rate of 3% per year. The future for Christians in Africa is bright and promising as Christianity is spreading rapidly across the continent. However, there are some challenges that Christian denominations face, such as persecution and poverty. The future for African Christianity will be shaped by these factors, which could either add to or detract.